Hello, and welcome to our first round of whatever you want to call this, okay? <laughs> Where we go through a brief rundown over both combatants and try to come down to a conclusion on, you guessed it, who would win, okay? Today's episode is a request by Xavier Ford, and he wanted us to jump into the Toho universe and take a look at two of the most oddball versions of Godzilla, which are Ghost Godzilla and Space Godzilla. Now granted, Space Godzilla is a Godzilla villain, but just look at him. <laughs> okay, but anyway, to me, this is one of the more intriguing battles because both monsters' powers have complete opposite sources, but comes down to a debate of weakness and situation. Um, like on one hand, Ghost Godzilla is the only version of Godzilla who has been resurrected or created, however you want to look at it, not due to radiation, but actually the souls of War World 2, hinting that this version of Godzilla is obviously supernatural. While Space Godzilla, on the other hand, was created due to the fact that Biolante and Mothra cells mutated together with some type of radiated crystal material and created this cosmic level entity. And I think that's what makes this unique because one is a supernatural being and the other is a cosmic level entity and both sides have shown great feats of power but only one is stronger than the other so getting into that let's first talk about ghost godzilla now once again the interesting thing about this godzilla is that he might not just draw his strength from radiation but a theory i have is that he can also reap the souls from other living beings which we did see from the three guardians in GMK, but take with that what you will. However, Space Godzilla draws his strength from his own crystals that he can emerge from the ground up and charging himself like a battery that never stops charging. But the only downside to this is he's like a power plant that constantly relies on coal and without the coal, he is pretty much, well, not powerless, but not getting the source of power that he needs, while Ghost Godzilla is always at a constant level or increasing over time. Now let's talk about how they fight, starting off with, of course, Ghost Godzilla. Now to me, this is one of the Godzillas that doesn't rely too much on either if it's scrapping or if it's his atomic breath. With that said, this Godzilla is ruthless and is a nonsense fighter that can get caught up in the moment which means he focuses on what he is doing in any particular part in time while also not letting his guard down and always has an open mind. Space Godzilla, on the other hand, unlike Ghost Godzilla, is not balanced but one-sided and relies too much on his power and is not a brawler. But to counter that, he does have many abilities. Um, some examples are gravity manipulation, lightning manipulation, earth manipulation, teleportation, telepathy, flight, and so on and so forth. So essentially, Space Godzilla is the type that runs through his bag of goodies and throws whatever he can at you basically. All right. However, it's time to decide who would win this matchup. And I gotta admit guys, it's a close one, but I think Ghost Godzilla would win this fight due to the fact that this would ultimately come down to a physical fight, more so because Ghost Godzilla would limit Space Godzilla and get up close. Even if this turned out to be a power on power match, it still goes to Ghost Godzilla, despite how many abilities Space Godzilla has. Ghost Godzilla has shown to represent such power in his breath that it is capable of blowing other kaiju into bits with a single blast. So because of that reason, I would have to give this one to Ghost Godzilla. Alright guys, so I want to say thank you so much for watching and let me know which out of the two you would have chosen as the victor in the comments below. And I will see you guys soon in the next video. See you guys soon.